Hi you guys. <clears throat> Fishing season is back, everybody. I'm excited and all of you fishermen at home, I know you're excited. And today I'm going to be recommending the top 10 best lures for you in your salmon fishing experience. All right. So the first one in the top 10 is of course mixed veggie. I absolutely love this lure. This is one this is my top 10 favorite lure ever made. I'm pretty sure in the fall as of 2023, it is May April 18th. I'm sorry, I'm really excited for May. Um but in the fall, mixed veggie will absolutely kill them. Salmon, they love this thing. Okay? I'm really pumped about mixed veggie because it's worked for years. I mean, it'll never... I don't... I'm not sure if it'll stop working. But, as of right now, it's worked practically forever in the fall. So, that's top 10. Alright. Top 9 is Goldilocks. Now, this is a silver version, which I honestly think the silver one is a little bit better than the gold one. But, if you can only get the gold one because I think they stopped making the silver one, then definitely get the gold one. This one will also kill them in the fall. They might in the spring. Um, it is currently spring right now, even though it's literally like 34 degrees outside, something like that. Um, but I'm really pumped about Goldilocks. I think that this thing will catch quite a few fish for you in the fall and spring. In summer, this thing might work. I know for a fact it'll work in the spring, and I think it'll work in the fall. So that is Goldilocks, silver edition, but it also is good in gold. Alright, next one on the list is Blue Flounder. Now everybody knows Blue Flounder is a good lure. Well, I'm not sure if everybody knows it, but in my opinion, Blue Flounder is a really good lure, um, for, like, we haven't, we've only tested it a couple of times. This one's brand new, it hasn't been in the water, but a friend of ours, um, he actually allowed, um, well, my dad actually allowed us to get this one. So, that is top seven. This is a really good lure for, I think, the spring and fall. I'm not sure. Um, but all I know is that this is a good lure. So, up to the next lure. Alright, this one's related to Blue, Fla Blue Flounder. It's pretty much the exact same thing. It's Flounder Pounder. I mean, the only difference in between the two is that this one glows blue and it has a green tip this one glow, glows green and it has a blue tip they're just the exact opposite of each other with the flippity charts all right up to the next lure that was flounder pounder and it's top six pretty good lure all right top five is watermelon made by moonshine this is a really good lure um, I like it because we've caught quite a few fish on this. I'm an experienced fisher. Trust me. Watermelon is a good lure. Alright. I've kind of lost count. I think this is top five. But this is tangerine. This thing in the spring will kill them. Sometimes in the fall, but it's not as often. But this thing will literally kill them. Literally. This thing is amazing. I love this thing. Um, We've been using tangerine for years. This is one of the best lures we've ever had. Um, So thank you. I think Silver Streak makes this. I'm not sure. Or Dream Waver. Something like that. I'm not sure. But all I know is that tangerine is one of the best lures ever. This is an older one. I honestly think the older one worked a little bit better than the newer one does. Um, which, I'm not gonna go all the way into my tackle box and get one. 
but the older one I think worked a little better, and that's this one. So that is top five. All right, top four is um I forgot the name of this one, but we're gonna call it Green TNT because I think that's what it's called. I'm not sure, but please don't shout me out to anybody. Um, but still. I would love to be viewed more, so make sure to like and subscribe. But this is a very good lure in the fall, in, in the summer, actually. This thing will kill them, not so much in the spring. The first time we've seen that coming. But this is a really, really good lure. I love it. The Super Slim one works better than the Magnum. Um, So, if I had to recommend you one, it would be Super Slim. So that's top four. All right. I had to give it to this one. Top three is Chalk Bloody Nose. That black dot is just, um, so then we can tell the difference in between R and somebody else's lures. But, um, this is Chalk Bloody Nose, okay? This thing is amazing. Um, I love it. This is probably... Well, it's my third favorite lure ever. Um, it's amazing. This thing has been one of the best lures we've ever had. Definitely would recommend this one to anybody out there who is wanting a lot of fish in one trip. Go pick up a couple of chalk bloody noses from a local tackle shop of yours. Maybe Bass Pro Shops, I don't know. But this thing is amazing. This thing kills them in the spring and fall, for a fact. Um, so I think that this is my top three favorite lure pick. That's top three. Alright. This one is custom made. That's why it looks a little bit off. Moonshine actually quit making this, which I'm kind of upset about. Shame on Moonshine for quit making this, but I bring it back. I'm not going to tell you how it's made because um, I just don't want to, but um, for personal reasons. This is the top two lure of the year. This thing kills them in the fall every single year. Um, This one is amazing. I love it, and I will never stop loving it. This is amazing thing. Um, and you would say, how could that thing catch all those fish? Or how is it the top two pick? I'm an experienced fisherman. Again, trust me, I'm experienced. And from my experience and my father's experience, my father is even more experienced than me. Um, this is the top two lure. I have one more, only one that's better than this, okay? One lure in the whole world for salmon that's better than TNT. Okay? And I'm just letting you know, the other one caught a 20, I think it was 4.3 pound salmon. That is big. Especially for my age. But I'm saying is that this thing kills them only in the fall. So... Um, I love this thing, and you probably fishermen, you guys probably remember it. Um, TNT, you know, dynamite, they may call it in some other words, but I love this thing, and everybody should. All right, the best lure in the world for salmon. It's the blue TNT. I love this thing. I will never stop loving it. Um, Moonshine officially quit making this, so shame on Moonshine for quitting this too. This and this are the top two lures of the world for salmon right now. That's amazing. I'm telling you right now. I'm an experienced fisherman, as I've said twice already. This is the third time. Um, 
This is the best lure in the world. This thing kills them in the fall only. Um, just like the red one. Blue TNT. I love it. I'm not sure if that's the real name. It's just what I call it. Um, I love it, and I think everybody should, because this caught a 24.3 pound salmon. That is big, especially for my age. It's giant. Um, I will show you a picture of the salmon right before I go. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. I will show you the picture of the salmon before I go. All right. That is one picture of the salmon when I got it weighed. It weighed 24.26 ounces. Or 26 ounces and 24 pounds. That's a big fish right there. That's the biggest fish I've ever caught. Um, and I will show you one more picture and then the video will be over. All right, this is when I caught it. This thing is giant, as you can see in the picture. It didn't even fit in the frame. Um, but this is amazing. I love this thing, this salmon. It was the best food I've ever eaten, outside of some other places. But this is some of the best food I've ever eaten. This little thing caught this thing right here. It looks small. It was way bigger in real life, but that's because this is on an iPad. But still, this thing caught that. That's a really big salmon. Um, so make sure to like and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. Um, and I hope you enjoyed the top 10 best fishing lures of 2023 for salmon.